Disposal of Seeds The main function of the fruit is to help the seeds spread. This is called dispersal of seeds. Dispersal is very important as it ensures that the species is distributed over a wide area. Fruits and seeds are usually dispersed by wind, water, animals and explosion of fruit. Wind, water and animals are called the agents of dispersal. Wind dispersal. Seeds which are scattered by wind are usually small and light. Dandelion and cotton seeds have long and fine hair surrounding them. This makes it easy for the wind to carry the seeds away. Some seeds such as maple and drumsticks have wings attached to them which help them float in air. Water dispersal. Seeds of plants that grow in or near flowing water are usually dispersed by water. These have fruits and seeds that can float in water. For example, water lily, lotus and coconut. The coconut fruit has air trapped in between its husk. This makes it light and easy to float. Water carries these fruits and seeds to far off places. Animal dispersal. We enjoy eating fleshy fruits such as mango, papaya, cherry and gaw. After eating, we throw these seeds away. This is one way of helping the plants to disperse their seeds. Sometimes, birds and animals eat these seeds along with the fruits. The seeds are small and hard and they come out of their body as ways ready to grow. Seeds of gawas and berries are dispersed in this way. Some seeds have stiff hair, spines or hooks. These enable the seeds to stick to our clothes or bodies of animals and are carried long distances. Some fruits have special hook-like structures that cling to the fur or skin of animals. Explosion of fruit Fruits of plants such as balsam, pea, Geranium and touch me not burst open and explode when they are dry. The seeds get thrown off and are scattered away from the mother plant.